And we are back with another episode. Welcome back, Odie. So I was in my last episode. I had just got my unicorn horse up to five, which is pretty cool. Yeah. My gray horse is up to three, and then I also have a white horse over there that's up to two. So I was just trying to manage this guy, and then we got frozen, right? Yeah. So I guess I could put the white horse on this one. Now it's a three star Yay. gray horse. The undead horse I can't do anything with. Oh no. I'm frozen again. No, I'm what? not. I'm not. No, I'm I was actually I was pressing the wrong keys on my keyboard. Oh. So <laughs> Okay, let's check uh our stats real quick. My stats. Uh skill. So I'm ten points away. So I just got my last power up. And so I'm ten points away. So I think this episode I'm going to do a bit, a bit of uh, terraforming um, to get my levels up and then come back and do some base building because I really want to get close to Caden. What are you at now? Um, hold on, let me check. I am at 44. I need two, wait, two points? Three, more, two, three more points. Wow, dude. I'm so close to you, man. Yeah. Did you say you're at 44? Yep. Yeah, I'm three points away from you, man. Wow, oh, and I'm three points away from getting, from, uh, from getting level 45. Yeah. Um... I'm gonna go on this side today. And do some... Digging. Get my levels back up. And then I'm going to come back. Seems very interesting. All the mechanics. Yeah. Eat some food. Come back. So, um, what's your terraforming at? My terraforming? Yeah. I know it's not a lot. Um, and, uh, terraforming is, wait, my terraforming is at 62, but my base building is at 29. Oh, okay. I got my terraforming up to, um, 71 now. Whoa. Right? Isn't that cool? Yeah. Papa? Yeah. You wanna know something? You wanna know my highest skill? What? Sprinting. It's at What's exactly it? a 100. Wow. You must sprint everywhere. Dude, when I first started to play the game, I didn't even know what skills were. So all you did was sprint everywhere? Yeah, I literally, I didn't even have a horse. I just sprinted everywhere until I met Ring Rider. And then I started sprinting some more. Actually, you won a lot in this game. Yeah. And that's why I got so much stamina. I sprinted some more, and eventually I got. Some more. Are you Are you maxed out on your stamina yet? Oh uh, no. How many hearts do you have across the top? Is it okay? Is it at the line in the middle? You know, you know where the line is. Where it kind of shows you the middle of the screen. I'm trying to count, and he just messed up my count. No, I'm just asking relative to the line on the middle of your screen. Nine, 
19. Oh, so I think you're one away from being max. Wow. Let me do this row and then I'll count myself. Yeah, I'm one away also. Oh, nice. I think we should do some uh, more fighting. Do you want to see if we can do the Ziggurat battle without um, the ring? It'll be hard. Yeah, it'll be harder. It'll be a lot of arrows. Yeah. Well, I was thinking, should we try to do the bomb arrow one? Um, those are really expensive. I don't really think to do it. I'm just gonna get 200, I think, because I don't want to spend too much time doing this. I want to get my levels up, but I don't want to spend way too much time. Oh yeah, and we were supposed to experiment with how much, um, like resource gathering gets you too. Yeah. I don't even, I don't really understand what you mean by that. Well, I, if we spent, okay, just say, remember how we had to spend time getting, um, resources to, to build, uh, to, to get our armor and stuff like that? Yeah. Right? Well, uh, we needed that for the armor, right? Yeah. But what about if you were tr just trying to find a way to, the most, uh, optimal way to make sure we make the most money and... Uh, we get the most level. I think that is monsters. What do you think monsters? Killing monsters is the way to go for that? Yeah, and also Ziggurat is the fast way to get your skill up there. Fast way. You get to, um, uh, you get to get to points. So I think fighting is the main thing you should be doing. So Ziggurat gets you a thousand coins each time. But yeah. how long does it take you to do the fight? Let's just say... With uh, obviously really with the ring, it was fast, right? Yeah, but with so, arrows, I think just doing arrows, arrows you actually a lot. First of all, uh, so it would probably take I don't know, max two hundred. Okay. Like max, and probably the least would be one hundred. Yeah, between that you could probably beat Zero and a pretty good amount. Yeah. So, the main pinpoint we're looking at is one. Yeah, but how long does it take? So, does it take 20 minutes to defeat Ziggurat? And well, it depends. Eight... Papa, depends yeah. if how well we do, like, how well would it be. If we get knocked off five times, it's probably take the best. If okay. we get knocked off not even one time, then it's going to be a well, that's the thing. I think with the the ring, it was pretty fast. But I don't I don't think that's true without the ring. I think yeah, it's min you... at minimum ten minutes a fight. We could try it. We can both go in with enough arrows and see how long it takes to defeat him. But what I'm yeah, saying maybe... is, yeah, in ten minutes. So if you think about it, it's a thousand coins, right? So we would need to do what five medium chests. To get uh, a thousand coins? Uh. Yeah, I, wait. A million? Yep, about four or five.
Wait. Papa? Yeah. I think I know something. If it goes medium chest, it would take longer. I'm almost sure about it because, like, medium chest, you have to first of all find a medium chest, second of all open it, third of all we're gonna get all the stuff and then set it yeah. along with all my identity coins. Now, give, give us a lot of money, but for one to find one medium chest and collect all of its stuff, that must take five minutes, and doing four of those would take like 40 minutes. I don't think it takes five minutes to find a chest. I think, I think, uh, we have a lot of chests around our base, by the way. Especially the medium yeah. ones. <laughs> I understand that, but when I, I, I agree with, I agree with you, it's not, like, sustainable. Like, you won't be able to do it for a very long time. And also, you're gonna lose some of that money, too, by buying medium chest keys. Yeah. And, I think a large chest. If we find a large chest, that's like kind of like a jackpot. If we find it, do it. But like, mostly we're going after me. I think that's what you're saying. Yeah. So another situation is, if you come to the uh, the mountain and mine for ten minutes, looking yeah. for let's say specifically gold, or maybe even you don't have to be specific. You can just mine various resources, right? Uh, but if you're if you're just looking for gold, let's say in ten minutes, how much gold mining could you get? Like, could you get like forty gold, let's say, in ten minutes? And then if you sell it, how much money does that make you? Gold so, is a hundred a piece, I think. It's a hundred a piece? Maybe it's. I don't know if it's a hundred, but. We'll, we'll sell it. And it's a gold bar rather than an ore, too. A gold bar would probably be like a hundred. So I let's, check, what, let's like, check them all. I'm going to check what the price is for the gold bar. If it's 1,000, the... then of course I'm going to do it. It's not going to be 1,000. But in real life, that would be it. Yeah. It'll gold be is, like gold is worth it. Wait. Gold is worth uh, not a million, but it's like I think right now gold is worth a thousand dollars. No, wait, more than that. I think it's a million. Paul. It's not a million. No. And we we're talking Papa. about you have to talk of weight. Yeah, Papa. Yeah. you are talking about paper gold. Paper gold is one thousand. But a uh, uh, like ingot of gold. I'm not talking about what? What's paper gold? I've never heard of paper gold. Okay, look, to to sell gold ore, it's 27 gold, okay? Yeah. To think about it, if you do one monster club, it's 28 gold. Yeah. So that's not worth, the ore is not worth it. So let's try to uh, cook it up and see what we get. Okay, how about this? I'm going to get one piece of gold. I'm going to set it. But actually, there's a much easier way. Of it. I think I I'm, I'm just gonna sell the gold that I found, so. Oh. Don't okay. don't don't worry about it. Okay. So I will. So like a normal. Let's say. Oh, Papa! By the way, plasma cores. Know those things from those giant um, monsters? Give yeah. two two one. Two hundred. Two hundred twenty one. Okay, actually, you know what? I just got two of those. And they're not hard to get. So what I did was, I, I found a, a trick. Yeah. So what you can do is, um, you can get the guys to a flat surface, and then just yeah. kill them. So, let me see how much a gold ingot is. Yeah, but Papa. Yeah. So. You want to know something that doesn't make sense? Yeah, it, you Apparently. know what? It's not, it's not worthwhile selling those. Yeah, but Papa. What? Yeah. N so plasma guys are insane hard, right? Okay, the the elemental core that you were talking about. Yeah. It's it's only seventy one. 
It's yeah, only 71. Know. It's not 200 and... It, it's only no, 70... No, I was talking about... Pop it. Yeah. Which one are you talking about? The elemental core. First of all, you're wrong. On me, it says 143 for an elemental core. But a plasma Are you talking core, about talking buying about... it or selling it? Wait. I'm looking at... Uh, plasma... I was talking about plasma cores, Pop. Yeah, the, and the buying price is higher than selling. No. Go to sell. Well, you don't have one with you, but I it's like half. Us. It's like half the price. So, the elemental core is half the price. It's only seventy-one gold. Oh. Yeah. Why is this horse always in my doorway? We want to buy. How much is the plasma? To Sorry. buy or to sell? 71. 71. Yeah. And an elemental core is? Uh, to sell it? I didn't have one on me, but it's probably going to be half the amount. One. So, like, 100. I, I have one on me. 71. That's it? A flipping plasma core. Yeah. You got from a giant beast. It's the same amount. From my rock monster that I can eat in like that I can be in like five seconds. Yeah. That just makes sense. And even even the um, the uh, gold ingot, it's funny because you're getting gold coins. Think about it this way. This yeah, this game, there's something wrong here. If if <laughs> if you're trying to. Gold coins are smaller than a gold ingot. Yeah. Right? So they're saying one gold ingot is worth 37 gold coins. Yeah. Like if you were going to sell it to them. You'd probably be able to make like 100 gold coins out of a gold ingot. I know! Papa, do you want to know something else? What? I sold my gold armor. And they gave me 400. Like 400, 300. For a party around like two thousand. Yeah. I could have made little like I could have made little ten thousand points from that if I just broke it up. The which armor? Of uh, gold armor. Oh, go you sold gold armor? Yeah, I sold all my armor that I don't use anymore. You sold your gold armor though? Oh no no not my dragon armor. Oh. It's, Some other it's, gold it's, armor? Yeah. No, the thing before Dragon Armor, Gold Armor. Was there gold? I thought it was like silver or copper that we had. Okay. Or iron, iron, silver. Yeah. We had silver leather, armor. Leather, bronze, um, iron, silver. So I had gold. You skipped gold and went to Dragon. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that. I think. Yeah, I think I had gold and you didn't get. No, I think you skipped iron and you got. You had gold! Did I? Yes, you had gold armor. Maybe for like two episodes, but yeah, you had gold armor. Hmm. I don't think I had gold armor. I don't remember yeah. having it. I remember having I know I know what gold armor at least is. Yeah, but gold armor, I can get so much money from like chopping up gold. How could how can you chop up gold armor? Oh, you mean to make into coins? No, like, to make into coins, yeah. Yeah. So unfortunately, um, one thing I did, did not account for is when you take something and um, like make it into another thing, like for instance, a coin is not just the weight of gold, it also has different value. Like for instance, back in the day, if they made coins, they would have stamped it with, let's say, the king's face on it or whatever right and yeah. even though the gold maybe the gold was worth you know a certain amount for the coin 
but it may be worth more because it's accepted as currency. That was like a measurement, right? But because it's 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 stamped and everything with uh, markings and it gives the value, so it it can it can be inflated in terms of its actual yeah, value. Yeah. You want to know something? What? These coins, they have one logo on it that you can easily make, and that's a sword. It's not like any face or anything. It's yeah. literally just a. It's literally just a big sword. You can easily make that. Like you can close that on. The cool. So it would still be. You would still be able to um uh, make gold. In, um uh, coins. Yeah, no, I know. It's not about you being. So if you did it, it would be called counterfeiting, just like how we have money. So um, it it mean that you were making something that was meant for the government or the ruler um, to kind of control, right? Like for instance, like right now, diamonds in the world are by are being controlled by certain companies. Right, yeah. but if you go to other c countries, you can pull diamonds right out of the ground, right? Um, yeah. And it's the same thing, right? Uh, it's just some c there's like some uh, uh, companies that control the trade of diamonds, right? And because they control the trade of diamonds, um, those. The diamonds that you pull out of the ground, they could say are worthless, right? Or, or they call them counterfeit, or they give other names to it to make yeah. it seem like they're not proper diamonds. Yeah. Um, Papa. Yeah. I think we. Should, I think I completely forgot how we were playing. Right? Did for what? I think I completely forgot how we were playing Dragon. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I know. Actually, you know what? Our episode, we, we were kind of talking about some interesting facts, right? Our yeah. episode is just wrapping up now. Yeah, well. Yeah, so where are you? Um, I'm at my, uh, small guy. So yeah. we, maybe, maybe next episode we should... This horse, get out of my way, man. Um, Papa, we should party your, I know, episode over here. In my base. Yeah, because I know, I, I know, I couldn't get through my door because there was a horse there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's end it here. Where do you want to do it? Mm, Putting on the benches? Let's sit let's on a house. Okay. So, thank you for joining us. And on the next episode, I think we're going to go fight the grass. Try to get our yeah. money up. See you on the next one. Bye, everyone. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.